positive about the day. One, the crowd was terrific. It was an insane uh, student section was great. Um, I'm really inspired this early. Uh, to get off to a good start. It's good to have all the former players back. And, um, and a, lot of, a lot of former players back, which is great. Um, and, uh, you know, obviously, wish we could have for them. And um, that meant a lot to us today. No, I, I thought we battled. We didn't play particularly well at times, um, but we battled. Uh, we had a 22-16 lead, didn't finish the half. Uh, went tough enough during a stretch. Then we had a 46-43 in the second half, and had three or four really good possessions. And um, just came up empty on all of them. Then we had two or three really bad possessions uh, in the stretch. So um, give them credit. They're terrific. My gosh, they got good players. Um, we were great defensively until about the five minute mark, and then uh, I think they scored seven straight times against us. It was really the difference. Uh, we made a mistake on a wrong replace when it was a three point game. Um, so Dick here is, but gave him a wide open three. Kind of got him going. He didn't have a lot going in the second half. But, um, a couple you know, guys that we count on offensively just didn't play particularly well tonight, um, but give them credit. Uh, they were great defensively, so disappointing. Play hard. Questions, please. Don. When Anthony's down for the time game, he had it, and, and I think he's one for 11 at one point. Do you at, at some point think about taking him out and, and, and trying to sort of talk to him and get him to be focused, or are you just waiting for him to? So do what he's done. Yes. Yeah. Uh, well, we got you know our, our timeouts are like three and a half minutes, so you can you can lecture in the timeout. Um, we got about three or four of them all the way, go all the way in and come out. Just kind of got a couple of those going. I think that kind of helped. Uh, they did a nice job on. Them. They got great size. Um, you know, even now with Livers starting instead of Matthews, that you know. Add another shooter and even more size to their starting lineup. So, um, yeah, you know, Anthony, I thought he was trying as hard as he could uh, out there. Just couldn't really get anything going. Um, ran a couple of plays, got him some good looks, and just, just went, went going for him. So, it's one of those nights. I thought he had to really battle defensively. He's given up about six inches to the pool kid, five inches, whatever he's given up. He tried to battle him. So, on you know, a positive note, we turned the ball over last, we turned over the last possession, he was to nine. Um, so, we did a better job with that. Consulting engineers. In the past five years, our organization has completed over 1,300 projects in the U.S. and abroad, including many structures at the University of Maryland. For structural engineering and materials testing and inspection, call Meyer Consulting Engineers. What about Tusky's defense makes things so difficult for Bruno? And I think that is Bruno's toughest matchup. You got to ask Bruno. I thought Bruno had some point blank shots that he normally makes. So you know, maybe he was in his head. Whatever. Tusky's a wall up guy. He's not going to jump off and try to block it with one hand. So Bruno knows that. He's just got to go up and, and make it. I think it's physicality, not getting deep sometimes. Uh, we had played Bruno way too many minutes tonight. Um, just didn't have the depth, and their and their their players are good. And um, but yeah, I mean, Bruno kind of four four balls right at the rim, and maybe we could have got us going, or maybe got us a little bit bigger lead in the second half uh, when we had it. Just one of those days for him. Yeah, Mark, after a, a tough week for you guys in general, um, is there some concern about fatigue, or just concern about where you guys are at as you head into your finale up front? We're disappointed in the week, uh, but we got better today. I mean, our offense was much better. We just didn't make shots. I'm going to go back and watch the film, and, and I'm going to feel that way. We had much better movement, chain sides with the ball. We were much better than we've been, and uh, that's just a really, really good defensive team um, that was able to lock in. So I think we got better with that and turnovers. Our defense, you know, that's a hard team to guard. Our defense was pretty darn good until the very end. So. Um, we're just disappointed. You know, we're disappointed that we didn't win. It was a hundred years celebration. The players were back. We're disappointed. We won the win. 
we, we wanted this bad today, and we just couldn't do it. We just we couldn't do, couldn't do it. We just didn't get it done. So uh, we were group. We got a chance to get to 13 and seven. You know, and the toughest league I've ever coached against, toughest schedule, with the youngest team I've ever coached. So disappointed, but we lost to a top ten team that played better than we did today. Shot more free throws in our building than we did. And uh, they deserve one. Mark to, to build on that, you've got time is short now, you've got one game left in the regular season and the tournaments. Um, is there time to, to get better and to, to the time? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we got till Friday to get better, to get confidence, and we got to kind of learn we'll play by the following Thursday or Friday, depends what happens over the next week. Uh, we'll get better. Uh, I'll get a little bit deeper. Um, but, um, yeah, we, we, I think we got better today. I know it sounds crazy. And I don't know how you say that, Coach Lott. We got some really good looks. We got some really good looks. We got some really, you know, long, athletic, fast, bouncy team. That is an athletic team. They got. And uh, the kid makes the four sky looks. Are you kidding me? I mean, what I can get with four, um, how terrific is he? I mean, he's the whole difference in the game. And uh, so, it's one of those games. I, I love my team. I keep saying it. I know we're all disappointed, but these guys are giving us everything they got. Sounds genuine. You feel like you took the step forward. Yeah, wasn't that great? It was good to see. You hit the first three, and you got in foul trouble. That was probably the only disappointing thing. We had some fouls early that were fouls because we were too excited, and um, and I thought that hurt us. Not playing Jalen, Bruno had to play more minutes. We got a little bit tired. Bruno got a little tired because of it. But no, Jalen made some big time plays, offensive rebounds around the basket. You know, I, I know he's feeling better right now. So it's, it's, it's a good possible moving forward. Thanks.